Hey everybody, it's me Arlene, Delicious Delights. Welcome to my channel. So today I want to talk about a scent that has been on my mind ever since I reviewed this. I've gone through some samples of it. Didn't think that I needed a bottle of it, but as the days passed, I just kept on thinking about it more and more. And I decided to get it because I just absolutely adore it. I think this is probably my favorite release for the year so far. Um, of course, the year isn't over yet, but this probably is going to be at the top of my list uh, when I do my favorite scents of 2022 later in the year. So it just came a few days ago and I am stoked about it. It's from the house of Lancome and it's a flanker of La Nuit Trésor. It's the intense version. So I did pick up a small 30 ml bottle you guys, I'm just so in love with this scent. <laughs> I know I reviewed it like recently, but I just wanted to talk about it again because it really just is something that I am just crazy about. Oh, I like that there's the braille right there. So, La Nuit Trésor Intense Lot de Parfum. Probably my most favorite scent of the year so far. Here is the bottle. It's very, very, very cute. I love the, uh, the little flower here. This is probably now my favorite from the collection. I do own one other scent from the collection. It's probably my second favorite now. It's the nude one, but they're just, both of them are just so, so sweet and delicious. Uh, for me, they make me feel extra feminine and pretty and I just love the way the bottles look and I love the way these ones makes me feel. So now we have the intense version here. Yeah so when I first tested it I liked it a lot actually. So this one has this beautiful cherry note. It is probably my favorite cherry scent now. Uh, my holy grail cherry perfume. There are a few other cherry scents that I own. I'm thinking of my Lolita Lampica Sweet, but I don't know, this one kind of just, for me, blows it out of the water now. <laughs> we get this sweet cherry that is tart and it has this nice jamminess to it. It is delicious, it is very sexy. It also makes me think of a dark red wine and then you have like those ripe cherries floating in, in the wine and also some almonds in there. So it is a delicious, yummy kind of scent. Also, as this one dries down, that almond note does start to come through more and it's also a delicious almondy marzipan kind of thing. And oh, you guys, <laughs> as I said, I know I talked about it before, but I'm just so crazy about this scent right now. It's not the most complex scent ever, but it's just so fun and cheerful and makes you feel good. And it makes me feel more dressed up when I wear it. And I basically just wanted to share uh, my joy <laughs> with you with this new scent that I own, which is now something that I'm going to cherish in my collection. So yeah, that's La Nuit Trésor Intense from Lancome. Now I would love to hear from you guys if you have a favorite from the collection. There are some other beautiful ones. Um, for me, I really like the musk one as well, the musk diamant absolutely gorgeous. I might actually get that someday. But I'm really curious which of the new releases from this year so far is your favorite. Please let me know in the comments. For me, this is up there and also the Narciso Musk Rose Noir. A Musk Noir Rose, which I do not own. The reason is because I still own the original Musk Noir, which I think that I would you know, rather finish up first before getting something that's kind of similar to it already. So yeah, that's my quick little video for today. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you soon in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.